Protection is the UK's largest cat welfare charity. They look after and then rehome around 52,000 cats and kittens every year. Cats Protection finds loving homes for unwanted cats and kittens, neuters cats to stop unwanted kittens being born, reunites lost cats with their owners and provides lots of information and help about cats and cat ownership. As well as being the largest cat charity in the UK, Cats Protection is the oldest too. It was formed in 1927 and is over 80 years old. Most of the work at Cats Protection is done by volunteers. People who give their time for free because they love cats so much. Cats Protection branches are run entirely by volunteers and cover their local areas. Cats for rehoming are cared for by volunteer fosterers in their own homes. Branches fundraise to support their work and are always looking for new volunteers. Cats Protection have over 250 of these volunteer branches across the country. They also have 30 adoption centres, which are run by a mixture of paid staff and volunteers. Unlike branches, adoption centres are open to the public on a daily basis and all the cats live at the same site rather than in fosterers' homes. Cats Protection is paid for by donations from the cat-loving public, people who care about cats and want to help them as much as they can. When a homeless cat is brought to Cats Protection, it is looked at carefully by a vet. If the cat is poorly or injured, it can be treated until it is well again. Cats are given injections needed to protect them from some illnesses. This is called vaccination. All cats are given medicine to stop them from having fleas and worms. Fleas and worms are parasites. Parasites are creatures that live off another animal. Fleas live on the cat's skin and bite both the cat and humans. Worms live inside the cat's tummy and can make the cat feel unwell. Cats Protection also microchip cats so they can be found again if they get lost. A microchip is smaller than a grain of rice and it is inserted into the cat's skin between its shoulders and it works like a barcode on an item in the supermarket. The cat can then be scanned with a special scanner which tells you the address that the cat lives at. All adult cats that are brought into Cats Protection are neutered. Neutering is a small operation that stops a cat having kittens. It is very important as adult cats can have as many as three litters a year with five or six kittens in each litter. That's a lot of cats to find new homes for. Cats become homeless for many reasons. Sometimes their owners move house and don't have enough room for their cat anymore. Sometimes the cat's owner has died and the cat is left without anyone to care for him. Because many people don't neuter their cats, they often end up with litters of kittens that they cannot find homes for or afford to keep themselves. Sometimes people become bored with their cat or haven't realised how much work is involved keeping a cat happy and healthy or how expensive it can be. Kittens are very cute, but they soon grow up and older cats are the hardest for cats protection to find homes for. Thousands of cats and kittens are abandoned or handed in to charities every year. If only people thought a bit more about the responsibilities that owning a cat brings before they took one into their home. This would mean that Cats Protection would have to care for fewer cats. If you are thinking about owning a cat, it's best to think carefully about what the animal needs and then make sure that you are able to meet those needs. Cats need lots and lots of love and need to be treated with respect. We should always be kind to cats. They need plenty of food and fresh water. Adult cats should be fed twice a day. A kitten should be fed little and often throughout the day. Cats need to have vaccinations to protect them from serious illnesses like cat flu. Kittens have to be vaccinated at about nine weeks of age with a second dose given about three weeks later. Regular booster injections are then necessary throughout a cat's life. Your cat should be microchipped. This will make it easier to reunite you with your cat if it ever becomes lost. Neutering is a very simple and very important operation that prevents cats from having kittens. It's an owner's responsibility to make sure that their cat is neutered. Cats need regular grooming, especially if they have long hair. 
You will have to protect your cat from fleas and worms. Your cat will need toys to play with and a scratching post. Cats love scratching and a post will help prevent damage to your furniture. If your cat stays indoors, you will have to provide a litter tray so it can go to the toilet and keep it clean and tidy. If your cat goes outdoors, then you will probably need to have a cat flap fitted to a door that leads into your garden. You will also have to provide veterinary care for your cat if it becomes ill or gets injured. This can be quite expensive. Your cat will need proper shelter indoors available at all times and your cat will need plenty of sleep. In fact, cats spend two thirds of their lives asleep. If you have thought about all these essential things, love and respect, food and fresh water, vaccinations, microchipping, neutering, parasites like fleas and worms, play and exercise, grooming, veterinary care, shelter and sleep and you are ready to share your home with a cat, then Cats Protection is the place to visit. We have cats of all shapes and sizes who are looking for a loving home. All of the cats at Cats Protection have been checked by a vet, treated for illnesses, neutered, defleed, wormed and given vaccinations. Cats Protection do not charge for cats, but do suggest a donation to help cover costs. Everyone who visits a Cats Protection branch or adoption centre fills out an application form and is able to look at the variety of cats available for adoption. New owners receive a visit from a Cats Protection volunteer or a member of staff to ensure that they are suited to the cat. Together with Cats Protection, you can help give more cats a better chance of a happy home. You can find out more about Cats Protection, where our branches and adoption centres are, the work we do and the people who do it at our website www.cats.org.uk Cats Protection, caring for the UK's cats.